This week was the perfect mix of Cerrito sunsets, swimming with whale sharks in La Paz, and exploring La Ventana's best kept secret, all while sharing the magic of Mexico with my family. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to our channel and join the adventure. This is insane. Probably the coolest thing I've ever experienced in my life. Good morning! We are starting today with a beach day. We are about a 10 minute walk from the ocean from where we're staying and it has been nothing but blue skies and sunshine here. So looking forward to enjoying another beautiful day. We just got back from such a nice day at the beach, uh, making a quinoa salad for lunch in our adorable little tiny home, um, which we'll definitely give you a tour later, but for now we're hungry. We are just about to have some dinner and Dane is shaking up some margaritas. Buenos dias! Buenos dias! <laughs> Good morning! Good morning! This is our last morning waking up in our tiny home. We've just spent the last few days hanging out, catching up. We do head to the airport to pick up my sister today and I'm just really grateful to have my family here for the holidays. Morning coffees! <laughs> We have had such a wonderful time here at Vive Cerritos and we thought we'd just bring you along for a little tour of our tiny home. When you first walk in, there's a nice little desk here with mom and dad to greet you. <laughs> <laughs> We've also got lots of nice little hammocks set up everywhere to just hang out in and enjoy. <laughs> okay, oh, okay, okay. And then we keep going this way. There's a beautiful communal fire pit. Before we even enter, we also have this really nice outdoor seating area. This is kind of where we've spent all of our time, breakfast, lunch, dinners. It's just such a nice cute little spot to hang out in. And then our tiny home. When you first walk in, there's this nice little seating area here for everybody. There's a nice little kind of bar set up here. We've got a beautiful uh, kitchen set up. If you keep coming in this way, got a nice bathroom. It's got everything you need. Really cute sort of Mexican style uh, sink and tiles. And then we've got a nice shower. It's a waterfall shower, which I personally love. And yeah, lots of kind of storage space here under the stairs. We've got both upstairs bedrooms, which are my favorite part. So if you come up the stairs this way, got a nice big bed. <laughs> this is where we've been sleeping the whole time so that Mowgli can walk up the stairs. Over across the other side of the tiny hole, you get to climb up this little ladder. <laughs> And we've got another adorable little bedroom. It's two separate mattresses, which is nice because if you just have two friends, they can stay up here or my parents push them together and slept up in this bedroom. It's just cute and tiny and just the perfect little space. We are on our way to pick up Isa from the airport. You get to see your auntie. Hey, you get to see your auntie. Good. It's so pretty here. 
welcome. Thank you. Reunited. Woo! <laughs> One more member of the family. Mommy. We have arrived in La Ventana at our second Airbnb and it is beautiful! There is a really cute restaurant right across from our Airbnb, so tonight is taco night! Cheers! Cheers. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, yes. Yeah. Excellent. <laughs> Moby, okay, up. Yeah, good boy. Today is a very exciting day because we are going swimming with the whale sharks. <laughs> There's a whale shark. <laughs> we just made it to La Paz and we are walking down to our boat now. Pelicans. <laughs> They're so quick. We got so lucky with our jump and had about five or six whale sharks swimming directly at us from all different directions. Being surrounded by these beautiful creatures was both mesmerizing and breathtaking and by far the most exhilarating experience of our trip. That swam right underneath me. Like, oh, that was it. probably the coolest thing I've ever experienced in my life. That was wild. Like, it literally... <laughs> like its face was like oh yeah it, it was, was like, scary <laughs> it was a little it was scary that was awesome it's unreal Dane's is good, mine yeah. is literally just <laughs> shaking up and down. <laughs> Panic swimming. Was that fun? <laughs> Happy you came. Better than goldfish? <laughs> <laughs> After the most incredible day out on the water, we are just enjoying some lunch in La Paz. Cheers! <laughs> definitely an event happening in town right now and we just stumbled across the cutest little uh, market on the pier. There is nothing better than ending the day with just the most beautiful sunset. Like every single night the sunset in Baja just absolutely lights up the sky and yeah just the best way to end the day. Another day, another beach day. Dad is pumping up the paddle board. Girls are tanning. And there is Dane and Mobley. Mama gets to try paddle boarding for the first time and I love it. She's so cute out there. It is the morning of Christmas Eve. We already FaceTimed my family in Poland. They're eight hours ahead, so they were enjoying their Christmas Eve dinner. And now we are on the beach enjoying the sunshine. 
Did you find someone to play with, buddy? Oh, yeah. Oh, lucky boy. One of our Polish traditions is to share opłatek, so you go around and you share it with everyone and kind of give well wishes and all that kind of stuff, so it's super cute. Boy, Merry Christmas, buddy! Hey, buddy! Mowgli's second Christmas! Yes! Kiss! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Christmas Day consisted of lounging at the beach and some friendly competition to end the day. No. Still in. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> it is 6.30 in the morning and we are up to go watch the sunrise. It's my family's last full day in Baja, so we're just trying to make the most of it. Good morning, Mama. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Buenos dias. Buenos dias. Not in my morning. <laughs> I got that on video. <laughs> Today is our last full day all together here in Baja and we're spending it at a natural hot spring near La Ventana. It is absolutely beautiful and the cool thing about it is that you can only reach the hot spring when the tide is just right. At the moment we're just kind of building out the hot spring, creating a nice little pool so that we can all hang out and relax for the day. Give Chuch a kiss. Kiss. Aww, good boy. Such a good way to spend the day. Well, thanks for coming down. Oh, so fun. No worries. It was a lot of fun. 